Calculate the sample variance and sample standard deviation for the following set of data from a flight school. The values represent the number of new students registered per day. All right, so if we want to use Excel to calculate the variance and the standard deviation for this set of values, we need to first copy these values into Excel. All right, so now that we have the data laid out in a column format in Excel, we can use Excel's functions to calculate the variance and standard deviation. I'm just going to type some labels here for the problem. All right, so I've labeled the cells here variance and standard deviation. All right, so now next door in the cell next to those labels, I'm going to input the function to calculate the variance and then the standard deviation. All right, so the first step is to type equals, and then you need to type VAR for variance. All right, once you've typed VAR in, you can see that var.p and var.s show up there. We want to select var.s, and you see that it says it estimates the variance based on a sample. All right, so let's double click that, and then we're going to highlight the values we want to calculate the variance for. Once they're highlighted, you can go ahead and click Enter, and the calculation will be performed. Okay, so our variance works out to be 11.08824. Now for the standard deviation, we also have a function in Excel. So again, we'll type equal, and then we'll begin to type standard deviation. So we'll do ST, and it should come up for us from there. So you can see as I've typed ST, I have options for standard deviation. If I click this value, it says estimate standard deviation based on a sample of values, right? So I'll double click that, and then I'll simply highlight the values I want to include in that calculation, and then I'll press enter. And there's our answer for the standard deviation for the sample of values.